Hi, my name is Chan Ken Jin. Hi, my name is Chan Ken Wei. We, we are, are from, from SMK Field. Our, Our project title is, is My Alert. The coronavirus which caused us COVID-19, most people experience mild symptoms including sore throat, headache, fever, a dry cough, shortness of breath, and fatigue. However, in the subset of patients, the virus attacks the lung, causing much more serious infection, which can lead to organ injuries and death. Asthma is a major health problem. Asthma is a chronic condition that affects the airway in the lungs. Asthma affects people of all ages in all parts of the world. In 2016, the Global Burden of Disease Collaboration estimated that 420,000 people in the world die from asthma. That is more than a thousand deaths worldwide per day. How COVID affect asthma patients? Study shows that asthma doesn't raise your chances of getting infected with the coronavirus that causes COVID-19. But if you do get sick, your symptoms could be worse than other people's because you already have trouble breathing. Children who have asthma may be more likely to have more severe symptoms of any respiratory infection including COVID-19. So, how are we going to prevent asthma attack during this pandemic of COVID-19? What is our proposed solution? We believe prevention is always better than cure. It is critical for asthma patients to know the asthma triggers in order to avoid asthma attacks. Our aim is to prevent asthma attacks. Asthma can be managed. As long as you are able to reduce the exposure to known potentially harmful triggers, such as chemicals, smoke, or dust, the frequency of asthma attacks can be reduced. My Alert is a preventive care for asthma patients. My Alert gives signals to asthma patients that the air quality is unhealthy. My Alert is an indicator to give early warning about the polluted air which would trigger asthma attacks. My Alert monitors air quality and enables asthma patients to take prompt action. Let me brief you our methodology. The materials needed are Arduino Uno board, gas sensor, RGB LED, OLED LCD display, jumper wires, and USB cable. The making process of my alert. First, assemble all the parts into Arduino Uno board. Next, write code and upload programs into Arduino board. Then, we do the test run, and these are the results. My alert say hello. If the smoke level is below the limit, RGB LED is turned off. LCD display will show good on the screen. If smoke level is within the limit, green LED will blink to give warning. LCD display will show warning on the screen. If smoke level is exceeded the limit, green LED will blink to indicate danger nearby. LCD display will show leaf on the screen. When my alert detects smoke from far, green LED will blink to give warning. When the smoke is nearer, red LED will blink to show danger nearby. Children are advised to leave the scene immediately to avoid asthma attacks which trigger by smoke. The COVID-19 pandemic disrupted health systems and economies throughout the world since 2020. In many countries, essential asthma medicines are unavailable, unaffordable or unreliable quality. My Alert is preventive care to reduce chances of asthma attacks. My Alert is able to reduce unnecessary burdens such as hospitalization costs and reduce mortality from asthma. My Alert is easy to be worn and carried by anyone at any place. What are our future developments? Reduce the size of My Alert by using Arduino NanoBot, which is smaller size than Arduino Uno Board. Add in buzzer as another warning signal in My Alert to prevent if there is any defects on RGB LED. Enhance the feature of My Alert by adding in pulse sensor. Fast pulse rate is another indicator of asthma attacks. Lessen the global burden of asthma. Achieve sustainable development goal 3. Ensure healthy lives and promote well-being for all at all ages. Thank you.